Another beautiful summer-like day today. Hopefully you were able to get outside and enjoy it. And we're going to hang on to that weather for just a bit longer before we start to see some changes in the seven-day forecast. Here's a live look over Broadway Plaza this evening. Some people taking advantage of the nice weather out there at Trouble Brewing, enjoying some dinner on the patio. Current temperatures sitting in the low 80s. We're seeing a little bit of cloud cover here or there, but overall, not a huge concern. You can see on our storm track satellite and radar, we're nice and dry here in the Hoosier State. Seeing some rain shower action over in Iowa, Illinois, but it is dissipating as it moves off to the east. I'm not worried about this. What I'm tracking is this system off in the northern Great Plains. This center, this low pressure system, is going to track to the east. As it does, it's going to drag this cold front along with it. I say cold loosely because there's not a whole lot of cold air behind this, but it is going to bring us some rain showers and some thunderstorms during the overnight hours on Sunday night and into Monday morning. This is a severe threat. Basically, along and west of I-69 is where we're expecting maybe some isolated severe thunderstorms. Everybody in the green, the dark green, excuse me, is under level 1-5 risk for severe weather. Level 2 of 5 is in the yellow. Any isolated thunderstorms that do turn severe, I'm anticipating the primary threat being strong winds. Here's what that looks like on Futurecast. You can see we're mostly dry throughout the rest of the evening, and that's the same case for your Sunday morning. Maybe one or two very isolated rain showers popping up, but 99% of us are going to be dry. Wouldn't worry about the umbrellas. And then the sunshine returns in the afternoon, another summer-like day. But overnight, you're going to notice rain showers and thunderstorms moving in. You notice those spots of red on the map there. Those are where those strong thunderstorms could develop. As it moves to the east, it does start to weaken, and you're going to see the strongest of stuff hang off to the southwest of Fort Wayne and move to the south as we progress throughout the morning. Your morning commute right now looks on the dry side, unless you live off to the east of Fort Wayne. Could be dealing with some rain showers and some thunderstorms still about 5.36 to 7 o'clock. But then as we head into the afternoon, we should be nice and dry, and we'll see the sunshine return on Monday evening. We're hanging on to a low rain chance Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Models don't necessarily agree whether we will or won't. I think we won't necessarily see widespread rain, but there is a low chance we see it Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So your Sunday, looking pretty dry. Temperatures hanging out in the upper 70s at the noon hour, 83 for that high. And actually, I think we're going to get to about 84, 85 here in the Summit City. We are starting to see a pattern change. Typically, when you see the orange colors, that indicates warm air. But you notice that big blob of yellow and blue headed towards us. That's a shot of cooler air moving in late in the week. And it looks like we're going to get another reinforcing shot of air as we head towards the weekend. So meteorologically speaking for fall, temperatures do fall pretty quickly for this time of year. And this week, they're going to fall pretty quickly as well. 86 for that high on Wednesday. And then the first day of fall, 71 degrees for that high. And Friday and Saturday, Ooh, excuse me, I'm just dropped, tripped over the cords here. 67 and 68 for those highs on Friday and Saturday of next week. Uh, it's going to even struggle to get out of the seven, or out of the 60s for next weekend. You almost fell like this, fall. I'm going to quote our director, Brian, from earlier. This is why we clean our stuff up and we don't leave it out. Well, you tripped over, oh, court. Yep. Yep. Okay. <laughs> I can't recover from this. Listen, I've made dumb mistakes before, but that's not my, that one's that not mine. yours, so I will, I will let you have this one. Thank, just this one. Just though. this one. Fair. Awesome. Thank you. A new prayer.